Hey everybody, you were most likely seeing this video um, sometime in September, October uh, before ice season hits, but I'm out on a local lake here, around, lake, around the Detroit Lakes area, and I'm fortunate enough to get my hands on the new Eskimo E40 uh, 40 volt ice auger. And I mean, this, this is, this is gonna be brand new this season and I'm gonna drill a hole with it and talk about it a little bit and tell me what, I'll tell you exactly my honest opinion of, of what I think about it. So, I don't know, let's get to it. All right. So I just gotta hold, hold the handle down here, safety switch I assume. Wow. Like that was super smooth. Um, cut right through the ice really nice. I really liked how it punched through the bottom of the ice. It did not hang up at all. A lot of the ice augers, once you get to the bottom, raise the kicks through, auger kicks around a little bit. Uh, the first thing I notice about this is it's smooth, does not kick when it comes to the ice like that. It is extremely light, I mean, super duper light it comes in just under 14 pounds i believe somewhere around 13 and a half uh nice solid like nice solid large handles here so i don't feel like i'm grabbing on to say like a small stick i mean you got gloves on you're gonna good gonna get a good grip on this auger i know it comes with a, this is a four amp hour battery i believe it's rated for about 1200 inches of ice so um you know yeah, so it, it you know it it doesn't so 1,200 inches versus 2,000 inches like some of these like some other ice augers, but you know for me, it's gonna come in at a at a little bit better price point. Uh, I believe this. I'm pretty sure this weighs less than the 24 volt Strike Master as well. But yeah, nice and super smooth. Uh, you know, there's a few things about this auger. So this is the eight, eight inch synthetic flight. It's gonna come in eight inch and 10 inch synthetic, um, also eight and 10 inch metal flighting. And then now this, the eight inch synthetic actually has the turbo blades on it. <clears throat> so they all come with turbo blades. Um, really the only difference is metal flighting versus synthetic flighting. Um, you know, and there's actually some really cool options about this auger that I've thought about, and I've actually thought to myself, why doesn't an auger company come up with this uh, this thought uh, process let's say let's say i want to put my auger in my sled or maybe maybe you want to put it in your car you know and you and it's too long or, or whatever just for whatever reason you want to break this auger down fast um they actually came out with a quick disconnect for this auger which is really cool it's super simple you guys i'm just pulling up on this little wiggle pull comes out directly super fast i mean then you can pack this in however you want to do it same thing, goes back together just about as fast. Just pull this up. Goes together super fast, just pull this up, put that down, lift, boom, snaps back on there that fast. Um, you know, an Eskimo actually has some other features for it, so I'm gonna pull this off quick. There we go. I'm just gonna set that in the snow right there. So here we have your classic clip here to put your ice anchors in that you might want to put in your drill so on and so forth i the reason honestly the reason that i've never used one before is because i don't want to just i don't want to you know take this off the drill put this back on there have to put my auger flight back on with this literally carry in your pocket pop it on two seconds to just save yourself a lot of time and save a lot of time on trying to screw those ice anchors in on your wrists yeah so this this to me is going to come in super handy uh like i said I, I like to put this in my in my sled especially i have a smaller sled where this isn't um you know just going to fit in sticking out somewhere tear it down it'll fit in the sled nicely nice got got leds on the bottom here for drilling you know dark out so on and so forth got a nice switch here to lock that battery in place it can't fall out if you're riding on your auger or on your wheeler whatnot um and also the auger comes with a five-year warranty uh you know it's, it's pretty tough to beat that i know that they are going to be running some good deals on these augers this year you guys um 
And honestly, if I were, if I were you, just just from what I I've you know from what I've seen here today, I think that this is going to be the next big thing. I really like this auger. To be quite honest with you. So go online, go to your nearest retailers, and check out the deals that you're going to see on these augers this year.